My father is Catholic and my mother is Jewish. Which makes me the avatar of shame. <laughs> my first words were, I'm sorry. <laughs> my mother's maiden name is Berg. Yeah, Berg. That's usually what you add on to other last names to make them sound Jewier. <laughs> Goldberg, Rosenberg, Gutenberg. I actually thought that the iceberg that's in Titanic was Jewish for a while. <laughs> I want to make an all-Jewish porno and call it Synagogue. It's gonna be all asses and doses. I get mistaken a lot for being gay, but I have to explain to people I'm not gay, I'm Jewish. Because there's so many similarities between the two. We're both born that way. We both wear tiny hats. <laughs> and we don't, both don't recognize Palestine as a state of Israel. <laughs> Alright, do you guys like impressions? Yeah. Alright, uh, name a celebrity. Oh, Somebody. Tyler you sir. Perry. Name is Tyler Perry. Alright, Tyler Perry. <clears throat> this is an impression of my neighbor chasing their dog around at 5 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Charlie! Charlie! Charlie, get over here! Charlie! Thank you. <laughs> my girlfriend asked me if, that, if there was one thing that I could eat guilt-free, what would it be? I said, babies. <laughs> Because I feel very guilty about the ones I eat now. <laughs> you guys ever sucked in your gut when you step on a scale? <laughs> it doesn't work. I went in for a checkup recently, and the doctor was looking over my history. And he said, Matt, I noticed that you've gained a lot of weight over the last few months. Are you taking steroids? Are you juicing? I said, juicing? No. I have been caking a lot. <laughs> I hate having my photo taken because you know how they say that the camera adds 10 pounds to a person? Well, I look like I ate that person. <laughs> I'm a serial monogamist. I've only eaten tricks every day for the last 10 years. <laughs> I went down to LA and rode the subway for the first time recently. And if there's any truth in advertising, they should just rename it Fart Coffin. <laughs> does having sex with conjoined twins mean that it's a threesome? Because if it does, I have still not yet had a threesome. <laughs> I want to open up a gay bar in the airport and call it the cockpit. <laughs> and then open up a relaxing place right next to it and call it the landing strip. <laughs> I'm very excited because I recently just started filming the very first show. And it's, uh, it's called Man Vs. Mild. It's where I go around to all the Taco Bells across the world and see, and see how many hot sauce packets I can eat before I shit myself. <laughs> Like that one? Uh, I wonder if Hitler really just hated juice, but was too embarrassed to correct anyone. <laughs> Concentration camps make a lot more sense. <laughs> a lot of people say, America, love it or leave it. I mean, don't get me wrong, I really like America. I'm not ready for anything serious right now. <laughs> After years of surveys, I've discovered the one question that everybody will answer no to. And that question is, will you smell my finger? <laughs> will you smell my finger? Will you 
you smell my finger? <laughs> you don't want to smell my finger. <laughs> I think that vegans that are pro-choice should eat eggs. <laughs> Um, my girlfriend's cat just died, which means I won't be seeing any pussy for a while. <laughs> but it's great living with my girlfriend, because now I have an infinite supply of lotions and hand creams. <laughs> Alright, I think that's my time. Watch this